What is Pemphigus vulgaris? It is an autoimmune disease. What is an autoimmune disease? Well, the immune system protects us from pathogens, viruses, and parasites. How? Well, as soon as a pathogen is identified, it will be attacked by our body defense system. If an organism is foreign, then it will be attacked. So, foreign organisms are subject to attack. Autoimmune diseases are the result of a gigantic screw-up. The equivalent of friendly fire on the battlefield. When a U.S. artillery division opens fire on a U.S. division of foot soldiers. When the immune system of the body mistakenly identifies normal tissue as the enemy and attacks. Let's talk about the epidermis. The epidermis is the outer layer of skin. It consists of cells. Lots of them. They are held together by a type of glue. A skin glue. We call this glue desmoglein. It plays a vital role in cell adhesion. It ensures that cells within tissues stay adhered to each other. Pemphigus vulgaris occurs when the immune system attacks its own desmoglein. It attacks the very glue that holds our skin together. The immune system turns on itself with a vengeance. A white blood cell called a plasma cell produces an antibody, which looks like a big letter Y. Well, this antibody will lock onto the desmoglein and tag him for an attack, or it can block some vital opening on the cell that will prevent it from surviving. Either way, the desmoglein is in trouble. And your skin literally comes unglued. This follows. Skin breaks, dehydration, sepsis infection. Okay, that's enough for now. This is Hoboken Gare.